Hi again, my name is Rebel and I'm the Rebel Reseller and today's video is going to be a little bit different. Robert is always looking at the Goodwill Blue Box website. Just kind of see every once in a while he thinks he wants to buy a pallet or a what are they Gaylord of stuff. But he noticed a couple weeks ago that they have these denim boxes. Um, and they were like, a couple of weeks ago, they were like, buy one, half price, get the other one. No, it's buy one, get one. Buy one, get one. For they're twenty nine ninety nine. Right. For 10 to 12 pairs. But this week when he finally was, he, I mean, if you weren't ready within seconds, they were sold out. So this week he got ready and he actually won two boxes. So they were $14.99 $14 each. Essentially the same thing as the buy one, get one. Right. So, but we got two boxes of them. One of the things I like for us to be able to do is to buy stuff like this so we could let people know what's in it. Right. That way people have an idea of what they're going to get before they go spend the money on it. Look up Goodwill Blue Box if you ever have considered doing any of these box lots. I've done the toys, the stuffed animal ones, several times. The first couple of times it wasn't so great. After, I think they realized they can't just send all junk. So the last couple of ones I got were actually pretty decent. Um, but this is the first time we've done a denim box. They do do um, specialty type clothing boxes. They have they have Levi's Distressed 30 jeans for 130 And Big Star jeans 24 count for 250 it They actually have two of those in stock. BKE out of stock of course 24 for 250 Ariat 24 for 250 Vigos 24 for 250 they have three of those in stock right now and true religion 24 normally 300 they're 250 right so they've got a variety of stuff and i mean they do other stuff where they're doing y2k boxes supposedly they do jewelry boxes so if you were just go to their website and kind of see what they have but a lot of times they drop their new boxes Fridays at 6 and you need to make sure you're logged in, your everything is ready to go, you've preloaded your um, address and everything. Address, your credit card information. Otherwise, I mean, they're gone instantly. So we're going to share with you what we got. With the shipping, the shipping, they do shipping is $7 a box on these, mm -hmm. flat rate shipping. So it comes out to about $2 a pair. Right. And y'all, it's big. Look at this. I'm going to show you one box. It's this, supposedly 10 to 12 pairs, and I got two of them. Who knows what we're going to get, but Robert likes to list jeans. I'm going to tell you what's supposed to be in here. Okay. All right. What's supposed I forgot, to be? I forgot to do that, do that part. It says... Brands include Levi's, True Religion, Carhartt, Tommy Hilfiger, Wrangler Lee, Calvin Klein, Boutique, Label Brands, Mall Brands, Essentials, and more. So this is just a little bit of everything. everything. But I can't imagine they're going to put too many True Religion jeans in here at $2 a pair when right. they could be getting them $2 for, for, for ten, the... The other ones are $10 a pair. All right, first pair. We're starting out with Wrangler. Oh, we never find those around here. We find tons of these around here. It is a bigger size, so there's that benefit. Reasonable shape. Yep. They got some wear on the on the hem, but we sell these. They don't sell real fast, but these will sell for fifteen bucks or so. Yeah, give 10 or take. To fifteen, yep. All right. Well, I don't know this brand, Axel. Axel Foley? No, it just says Axel. Axel Rose. Axel thirty-six thirty-two. You know, if I can get, I don't know, 12 to 15 plus dollars for each, it, it works for me. All right, that's two. You keep count. Two. Oh, St. John's Bay. But you know what? They are in really good condition. So, not bad. Uh, I don't know about this pair, y'all. But... Wait a minute, it ain't jeans. It said denim, so look. Big old jacket. It says W-E-K. 100% cotton. It's got a logo on the front. Yeah, it's got a logo. 
Where's the logo for? It is Blue Ridge Parkway, Golden Anniversary. So that's from our our region. It runs Asheville up through Virginia. Yep. So there, that's not bad, I don't think. Ah, I like this pair. Riders. You know, I've sold a couple of pair here in the last few weeks, but a lot of times they're like eight and ten dollars. They're long tail. Yep. How many pairs have we gone through? I think five. Five. You told me to keep count, but I can't remember very well. All right, another pair of Wranglers. Oh, let's see. Oh, Forty-two twenty-nine. Those might be a hard sell because they're going to have to be for a shorter person. It's a larger size, though. But so it is a larger size. All right. Oh, these are kind of cool. Look. I don't see the brand yet. Let's see on the button. Nope. Huh. Oh, wait. Here we go. Shine. I can honestly say I have never purchased anything ever that was shine. So here we go. They're kind of cool. BKE. That's not bad. Fulton, size 36. Yeah, I'm going to just tell you guys, it does not have the Goodwill smell. If y'all know what I mean. It doesn't. These smell like they've been freshly laundered. So, I think that's, this is a good one. BK is a good brand for us. Yep. All right. Another pair of those axles. They were gonna, 9 to 20. 9 to 20. 25, depending on what you were looking at. There we go. Yep. All right. Levi's 505s. Let's see. More contemporary. You can always tell kind of they've got this kind of tag rather than that stiff papery, papery tag. But Levi's is Levi's. It's got a little stain on it. Oh, right does there it? On oh, the like a... a marker or something hit it. Yeah. Right, these are intriguing. Wrangler. They're Wrangler, 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 but they say Q Baby Ultimate Riding Jeans. They're small people's, small person. I don't know. Look, they've got handwriting on the tag. I wonder if these are special, very special. I don't know. That's just weird. Huh. Never had that. And look, they're like they've been pressed and everything. Starched. Yes. Yeah, the cowboy types like to starch their stuff. Yep. Like when I was doing the rodeo clown thing, they like to put the starch in the jeans and whatnot. All right. We say abound. They are button fly. It just it says size 31. I don't know. They don't feel quality but i could be totally wrong they just i don't know never heard of the brand i'm just sharing what we're getting all right it looks like we've got oh some kids we've got four kids all right these are children's place skinny size 10 I didn't even think that we'd get kids. All right, these are called Thereabouts Skinny Fit, size 12. Oh, these I'm not, look, the, they're the adjustable waist and that is all stretched out. Yeah, it's got some give. I don't know. I'll have to think about it. But it's children's place again. We don't usually sell kids clothes. So. And then jumping beans. I know that is Kohl's. What size? Eight. Of course, none of the kids' clothes could have been the same size that I could do like a lot of two. 
We got 8, 10, and 12. So how many? We got 11 adult jeans, the jacket, and then you say four? Four kids' jeans. That's not bad. That's not bad. That's even less than $2 each. So I, I said it was worth getting so, them in and that you're not sourcing. You're not driving. You're not. $22. A pair of the BKEs might, one pair of the BKEs that we got might cover all of it or a pair of Levi's and a pair of Wrangler is going to cover it all. Yep. And the rest there. is pure profit. Oh, and this is a nice size box to save for something big. All right. Second box. Better or worse? What's your, your, better or worse? Better. Better. Not off the top, though. Not off the top. But I can larger jeans. These are members mark, which is Sam's Club. What? In good condition. Larger size. You know, I, I'm hoping 10 or $12 for it. Okay, these look kid size. Levi's 550 relaxed. 14 slim. So now we've got 8, 10, 12, and 14. Those are really nice, nice condition though. Yes. All right, these are interesting. Oh, Walmart. Wonder Nation jeggings. Again, kids size 10 to 12. Oh, this is looking Wrangler. Carhartt. Oh, Carhartt. Not bad. We only get like, I want to say 12 to 20 bucks for Carhartts. I guess it really depends on style. These are, what it says, Cat 2 Relaxed Fit. But they are, they, they have an have FR a and a number two. Are they fire resistant? Is that what the, it says, it says Cat 2. That's all I'm seeing right here in the pocket. I don't know. I don't know. I'll have to look and see what that means. Oh, and they've been repaired. So that's going to take it down in value also. All right. These, I don't know. They are distressed, but, huh. Well, I don't know. I can't even read it. Jimmy's? Okay. Timmy's. Timmy's brand? Never heard of it. Right there. But look at the pockets, y'all. Got skeletons on the pocket. It says low rise boot cut. I'm thinking that's a T. Timmy's brand. Are you going to look these up? Sure. Interesting. A little distressed. Very interesting. Those, those might be what pays for the whole box. All right. These are Talbots. Talbots stretch size 12. You know. Very interesting. They're not the normal waists. I'm thinking the FR was fire resistant. The ATPV rating 16 was in there. It was on the tag. Mm. It's the arc thermal protective value. The maximum incident energy in calories per centimeter squared. That protective equipment can be exposed to and prevent the onset of second degree burn. So is that like welding? Used by welders and stuff? Could be some. Maybe. I'm not That's sure. That's what I'm thinking. All right. Lee Dungarees. Let's see. 3630. Carpenters, Probably. Carpenter's good. Oh, yeah. They seem oh, to I do didn't better. See that. Yeah, carpenters tend to do better. These are intriguing. Huh. K Gold. Don't know. K Gold jeans. Got that little leather like patch. To me, that's. Oh, and. You know what they look like? Like skater jeans. Look at these legs. 
big old legs. I'll have to get Robert to look these up. These are intriguing. What did you find on Timmy's brand? Nothing yet. Do you think it's Timmy or Jimmy? I couldn't find a sold on either one of those on eBay. It's oh, J I M M Y Z. Oh. Let me try that. Oh, yeah, I'm going to wait on you. Here, while you're doing that one, I'll look this one up. I tried looking this up. I'm not seeing anything. I'm going to go. It's 100% cotton. I'm going to see if I can find the RN number and see if there's a different manufacturer I should be looking up. But to me, I think just the fact that they look like skater jeans, I think that they're looking real trendy. They were K-Gold jeans, and that just kept bringing back Y2K. Y2K, everything. I even tried putting the K-Gold in quotation marks, and it didn't help any. All right, Kirkland Signature, that is Costco, I think. I think this is Costco. We've had a Sam's and a Costco, but, you know, really good condition. Larger size. Larger size. All right. Not a cow, but small. Straight fit, 14. I'm thinking this, again, is child size. All right, let's see. These, oh, I don't know. The pocket just says jeans the button i mean yeah the button oh i don't know well if you search for jeans on ebay you should get a lot of results at least yeah a lot of solds and listed i don't know y'all i'll have to see if i can find an rn number but my gut says probably something like um the amazon no name stuff private label private label that's the word all right, these, lots of wear. Route 66, or Route 66, depending on how, where you live. Probably, yeah, probably not even worth listing, to be honest. We'll see. All right. Axist. Axist. Never heard of that brand. If nothing else, we're learning some brands to either be on the lookout for or not. How about that? 2932. I don't know. Do definitely have wear. But sometimes the wear doesn't really matter in some of these brands. The sold comps on Axis are 7 to 20. Yep. Same. Bread and butter. All right, another pair of kids' jeans. Children's Place. Five toddler. All right, looks like we've got three more. Oh, another pair of jeggings. Walmart. Four to six. Time and true. Time and true. I'm thinking this box was not as good as the first box. All right. This, oh, another no, no brand. Let's see what this says. Carriage Court, made in the USA. Huh. There is an RN number. If you ever find something and all you have is an RN number, you can Google RN database or RN identifier and it'll pull up a database for you and it'll tell you who put it out. Best offer off of 15 twice. There you go. I, I list them for 15 and see what happens. And then last pair. So I wonder how many we got this time. You didn't count, did you? No, I didn't count this time. Dickies, cargo that's a, pants. That's usually a decent brand for us. Decent. Yeah. <laughs> Missing the size. Hopefully it's somewhere else, but it's something by 32, which is easy enough. Just measure the waist and you can come up with that. But still, 
it's it's worth two dollars a pair at the minimum so we probably won't do it a whole lot though because no. we have tons of clothes to process we have so much clothes you can take less of a risk on this because you have an idea of what you're going to get right you'll know i'll make my money back not going in and going well will i even be able to make my money back on this box you'll make your money back right and it's Plus, okay it, it, it's okay for those of you like me who don't mind the bread and butters but if you know you're one that's wanting only 20 plus dollar you know things to sell then this is probably not going to be the thing for you absolutely not so that's what that's, i like doing this sort of stuff i do too it's like being a, an explorer yeah would i have done it but i've done the toys so but you know if you're especially this winter if you're fi having a hard time finding you know sort sourcing from like the goodwills and stuff like that because around here the thrift stores stink um, it might be something to consider doing. I've done the plush. I've been happy with it. I'd rather find my own stuff than this. You know what I mean? But it's still an opportunity to have a place to source something for you. Yeah, the thrift stores around here generally on jeans, five ninety nine is the cheapest you're going to get them yeah. in, in adult sizes. Yeah. And, and some it, of them are nine ninety nine. Right. And that's Wranglers and Lees and brands that, you know, normally we'd pay two dollars or less for all right hope you guys enjoyed this something different probably going to turn right around again and do another plush video because it's time to get all this stuff processed so we can go on our vacation in a week and a half the next video won't be nearly as exciting as all these jeans right yeah all right get to work bye